everyone, I am covering West 2024 here in San Diego, California, and I am now with Ultra Maritime, who's showcasing for the first time in the US, the ASW Mission Pod. To learn more about it, I am with Andrew Anderson, CDO at Ultra Maritime. Andrew, good morning. Good morning, how are you? I'm great, thank you. It's uh, really great to be uh, here in the beautiful San Diego in California. So, ASW Mission Pod, can you please first uh, introduce the, the, the pod to us? So, the ASW Mission Pod is, uh, has been developed in response to the increasing demand for modular systems from many navies across the world. Uh, it's a towed array system in a single 20-foot ISO container. Uh, so, we can take a range of different payloads uh, from tactical variable depth sonars, uh, torpedo defense arrays, or strategic surveillance arrays. In this configuration on the model, which uh, which variant is it? So this is the Sea Lancer single tow active passive variable depth sonar. So it's a flexible transmitter array, which is quite unique to Ultra Systems. We have that system in service in Australia and are currently delivering that to Canada and uh, the Indian Navy. Uh, so the complete system is in the is in the twenty foot box, including the processing, uh, all the interfaces, and then what what is passed out the container is uh, essentially the display ready data, ready to go to a operations center or for an uncrewed system to a satellite. So you just mentioned uncrewed system, so it seems like that's the perfect solution for USVs, indeed medium sized USVs. Absolutely, that was one of our main drivers for this development. We are looking at crewed systems with multi-mission multi -mission platforms, uh, commercial vessels of opportunity, and the medium USVs, particularly here in the US, uh, with the medium and large USV programs that they have. Last but not least, Andrew, can you tell us a little bit about the performance of the, of the system? So, so details are classified, but I would describe it as a frigate-grade sonar, a NATO frigate-grade sonar. Um, as I said, it's in service with the Royal Australian Navy on the Hobart-class uh, destroyers, uh, and it's going on the Canadian Halifax Patrol-class frigates. So uh, definitely a, a, a five-eyes-grade sonar. It's a blue water sonar, not a coastal sonar. It does, it does both. So it does perform extremely well in shallow water, uh, where cavitation is a major challenge. So very shallow cavitation depth, but it can also achieve first convergence zone in deeper environments. And I suspect, can you do uh, multi-static ASW operations? A absolutely. Uh, Ultra is really a world leader in, in multi-static. So uh, the processing can be designed to process any in-band transmissions. All right, Andrew. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Enjoy the show.